All right, now this video is gonna be interesting because we will be talking about a brand new application update on the Galaxy phones. And I'll talk about a couple of brand new features which are coming up on One UI 8.5 beta. And I'll share a few more interesting information. So let's dive right into the video. Let's go to the Galaxy store here, tap on updates. You can see we have got an update for Samsung wallpaper. Now this is a bit strange. We don't really recall getting an update for Samsung wallpaper here. Let me just tap on this. Now you can see there is nothing new here, but it fixes a very important bug, which I'll tell you in a bit. Now, if I scroll down, you can see the latest version 2.5.81.1, and the update was released just a few days ago. Now in the description, if you see, it says Samsung wallpaper provides the dynamic wallpaper feature for Samsung Galaxy devices. So this is the one which provides the dynamic wallpaper feature. Let's go to the wallpaper settings here, wallpapers and style and let me tap on change wallpaper. Now here, if I scroll down, we have got this colors option. And under colors, Samsung added two new dynamic wallpapers on One UI 8.0. Now these were already there. These are some of the wallpapers which are static, but the dynamic wallpapers were newly added and this had some issue in the recent past. After setting a dynamic wallpaper, it used to get automatically changed to the default wallpaper. What I mean to say is, let's say you set the dynamic wallpaper now, after some time or probably overnight, the dynamic wallpaper will automatically vanish and you will get the default wallpaper on the home screen and lock screen wherever you have set it. Now that was a bug and many of you guys noticed that and you have been reporting it. And now Samsung seems to have fixed it with this brand new update to the Samsung wallpaper application. Let's go ahead and update it. If you got the update, do go ahead and update it on your phone. This bug will be fixed. And if you're someone who used dynamic wallpaper, this is gonna be very useful. Now I have not tested it yet. Uh, let me test it for a couple of days, whether it gets to its default uh, wallpaper or whether it will remain, I will let you know guys probably in the future videos. Now this is the first thing that I want to discuss. Next, we've got two new interesting features coming up on One UI 8.5. Let's talk about that. First, the Samsung internet is getting a massive overhaul that focuses on a cleaner, more intuitive user experience. Galaxy Techie Onyx has shared some screenshot. The update introduces a fresh app icon and a redesigned interface featuring a floating address bar that disappears as you scroll to maximize screen real estate. And that too, along with a grid view tab layout, similar to the gallery application for easier organization. The functionality is also being boosted with new tools like the ability to block fixed position pop-ups, a like button for videos directly within the browser, and enhanced security that checks the Galaxy Store when downloading APKs. With added customization options for the floating menu and smoother tab management, this upgrade promises to make browser faster and safer for Galaxy users. So that is the brand new Samsung internet coming up on One UI 8.5. Apart from that, Galaxy Techie has also shared some information about the new game booster. Key features include voice relay, a new communication tool that lets players send saved voice messages and access a voice market with downloadable packs and an anti-interference mode for customizable notification blocking. The update will also bring 4D vibration for immersive tactile feedback based on in-game actions, enhanced game care to monitor play habits, and improved controller support directly from the booster panel. Additional tools like voice changer using sound assistant, a super microphone that prioritizes the game audio, and Galaxy AI game help for strategy assistance make this a comprehensive upgrade designed to create a smoother, smarter, and more engaging gaming experience. That is the brand new game booster coming up on One UI 8.5. Now, here is another cool new feature tweeted by CID, the new One UI 8.5 feature, Now Nudges. Galaxy AI knows what's on your screen and suggests action to enhance your productivity tool. Let me just show you the screenshot here. This is the new AI feature. Here we have got get things done quickly. Galaxy AI will suggest actions to take based on what's on your screen. Recall important information. Galaxy AI understands what you're doing and shows the information you need when you need it. Fill out forms easily. Galaxy AI will offer to fill out forms automatically using information you have entered in similar places. So this is gonna make life easier. The AI will know in advance what we need based on the information on the screen and it will provide the information that we need for smoother and easier actions. This is gonna be game changing feature. Let's see how it works once we have the actual update.
Now, let's talk about the Galaxy Watch update. The One UI 8 watch has been released for the Galaxy Watch 6 series in the US, and we can expect this update to come to the Galaxy Watch 6 series in the other countries as well. I'm eagerly waiting for this update on the Galaxy Watch 6 Classic. As soon as I get this update, I will share it with you guys. There are some amazing new features coming up with this update. I've already posted a comprehensive video about the new features on One UI 8.0. I will also discussing this once we get the update on the Galaxy Watch 6 series. So stay tuned for that video. So the One UI 8 watch is on its way to the Galaxy Watch 6 series across the globe. The last interesting thing I would like to discuss is that the Chinese phones are working on offering 10,000 mAh batteries on their mobile phones. And that is going to happen probably in the next two to three years down the line. And that sounds really crazy. Imagine Samsung is still at 5,000 mAh battery on their flagships. And even this year, the Galaxy S26 series may not come with more than 5,000 or 5,200 mAh battery. But whereas Chinese companies are offering already 7,000 plus mAh batteries on the brand new OnePlus, Oppo phones, etc. And that could reach 10,000 mAh. Just imagine having two to three days of battery performance on your phone. We are going to just forget charging your phone for more than two to three days. That sounds just crazy, isn't it? So it's time Samsung wake up and start improving your hardware. All this while, for the last few years, Samsung is only focusing on AI and not doing enough as far as the cameras, the battery, the charging speeds, and a lot of hardware features are concerned. And as Samsung Galaxy fans, I think we should protest this. We should ask Samsung to improve the hardware features as well. Otherwise, they are just going to lose the market share in coming days. There are many people, there are many Samsung users already switching to phones like OnePlus, Oppo, etc. And it's really sad to see that happening. So it's time Samsung improves its hardware along with the software experience. This is something which I wanted to share with you guys in this video. Let me know what do you think, drop a comment. And while you do that, be sure to subscribe to the channel. And don't forget to download our wallpaper application, Wallverse. We are running a promotional campaign. 50% discount is available on the lifetime membership. And that's available only till the end of this month. And the prices will be double from next month onwards. So if you're interested, do go ahead and grab this offer. Offer. There are some amazing collections, beautiful wallpapers. You can unlock all the collections that we have and you'll be able to download the wallpapers without running any ads, without seeing any ads. So do go ahead and check out the link. And while you do that, be sure to hit the like button as well. Thanks for watching. You guys take care and stay safe. Cheers. Bye-bye.